Hey everyone, in this video I'll be going over step by step how to set up your CAC reader. Now before we begin, I want you to flip over your CAC reader and look at the sticker behind it. It'll tell you the model number and also the version of your CAC reader. As you can see, the model number is the SCR3310 and it's a version 2. Now you want to write this down on a piece of paper as we will need it later on in this video. Since we checked the CAC reader model and the version of it, we can now type into Google or any search browser of choice the model number of your CAC reader along with the word drivers. As you can see, there's two that populate, but since mine is the version 2, I'll click on the bottom link as such. Once it loads, this is what it'll look like. And as you can see, there's a description, a version, and a date. You want to make sure that the description follows what you're trying to download. So in my case, I'm downloading the Windows for driver for my CAC card reader. And the version is up to date. And the date is also very recent. Therefore, this would be the one I'm downloading. Once you click on download, this is what the file will look like. Now this is a zip folder, so what you'll need to do is right click on the folder and then click on extract all. This is what it'll look like and you want to click on extract. Wait for it to load and this will pop up another window right here. Now you want to click on application, double click it, and now you allow this app to make changes to your device. Click on yes, and the CAC reader setup will initiate. You simply click on next, set the terms, click on next, click on install, wait for the status to load. This might take a little bit, but depending on your computer, it might be faster or slower. And as you can see, we are now finished. Now your CAC card reader should be ready to go. And if you still have issues, you can simply do the other steps such as checking your Windows version or making sure that you have the DOD root certificates installed. I'll show you another video on how to do that, and I'll link it below. If you found this helpful, please consider leaving a like. Thanks for watching.